All right, so this is what's up. President Biden. Man, I'm really wondering who's in charge. But before we get into it, make sure that you stay tapped in. Follow me on Twitter. Twitter is where you're going to find the content, the video, the article that I'm covering right now. So yeah, if you're new to the channel, also make sure that you subscribe, like the video. Those things help the channel out tremendously. So without further ado, so this is the issue right here. President Biden is in Vietnam giving a speech. Five pre-screened questions from reporters were on a monitor. All he had to do was read and answer the question that I'm pretty much sure that he practiced. But he started to venture off. Like telling stories of days past or imaginary stories. I'm not sure which of the two or either of the two it was. But nevertheless, he started talking about things that were unrelated to the question. He didn't even make it past the first question that he's mumbling about all sorts of things. And then some woman gets over the loudspeaker and basically it's over with. Questions are finished. Uh, thank you. And then they start playing music like they were at the Grammys. You know the music that makes people like understand that you're done? Even if you think you still got time, you're done? I've never in my life seen a world leader, especially a president of this country, being put in a position where they can't speak freely. And probably for good reason. I think that President Biden, you think what you want about the guy, but something needs to be appreciated by somebody who makes it to that age. And at some point, you just gotta understand that it's good to just go off gracefully. You know, enjoy what's remaining of your time here on earth. Enjoy your family. Enjoy the things that you like to do. Don't be traveling across the world giving speeches and then just mentally not there. It's like you're there, but not really. I don't know. Get in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this after you saw the video. My thoughts are the people around him, the people who, I won't say like his handlers, but people who are in position to make sure that he's good, whatever their titles are some accountability of like just letting the guy know like just start to wind down and look forward to your time off in front of world leaders I'm talking about like this all took place in front of world leaders so the question is what's next for President Joe Biden does he go for re-election all signs say he will but it's starting to seem like they're trying to usher in someone else. Who is that someone else is the question. So yeah, like the video, share the video, stay tapped in. More content coming out soon. Till next time.